For the Centromag circuit build, you'll need one Medtronic ECMO tubing pack, one Nautilus oxygenator, and one Centromag pump head. Remove priming bag and tubing and hang across IV poles on the circuit. Here is the manifold and oxygen tubing, pump inlet, pump outlet, trash connector spikes, keep 3 8 lure lock connector, keep 2 3 8 straight connectors, keep stopcocks, keep 250 mil syringes, Keep zip ties, keep quick prime tubing. Open Centromag pump. Its packaging is just like a Russian doll. Insert cone in the holder and mount in place. Remove Nautilus oxygenator. Blue end is the Venus inlet, yellow cap for burping air, green pour up top for oxygenator tubing, red outlets for post socks and arterial end, blood out, blood in. Heater slash cooler connectors, Slide Nautilus onto the holder until you hear a click. Oxygenator can spin around 360 degrees while remaining firmly in place. Uncoil tubing until you can access the blue and red ends easily. All circuits must be assembled using aseptic technique. Remove 3 8 fluid lock connector and attach to the blue end using aseptic technique and alcohol swabs for lubrication. Use the connector packaging or an alcohol swab to ensure sterility on the opposite end of the connector to avoid contamination from your dirty, grubby paws. Use a firm, forceful, circular motion to slide tubing down the connector. Attach the other end to pump inlet tubing. Ensure all connections go past the second barb. Attach the other end of the pump inlet tubing into the inlet portion of the center mag pump head. Ensure all connections go past the second barb. Use a firm, forceful, circular motion to slide tubing down the connector. Connect pump outlet tubing to the outlet end of the pump head. Remember counterclockwise turn to lock into place. Then tighten screw. Connect the other end to the blue venous end of the Nautilus.
attach red end of tubing to the red arterial end of the nautilus. Attach flow probe post oxygenator and ensure the arrow is facing the direction of blood flow. Attach oxygen tubing to the nautilus. and the O2 tank. There will be a drawer at the bottom of the cart for extra storage. Add three-way stopcocks to the lure lock connectors between the pump head and the oxygenator. Replace non-occlusive clear caps with the white caps provided. Attach manifold to holder. Tubing can be switched around depending on circuit structure to avoid crossing and tangling manifold tubing, but be careful not to contaminate by touching connections. Uncoiled tubing. Notice the arrows and one-way valve to show direction of flow. Attach the side with the one-way valve to the top connector on the back arterial side of the Nautilus. Attach the other side to the closest lure lock connector on the negative side. Attach microclaves and green caps only when ready to prime. Zip tie the added connections by tightly connecting to the middle barb of connector. Use zip tie gun to tighten and cut off the excess. Lightly press the trigger a few times to tighten the zip tie to the connector, then firmly pull the trigger all the way to cut. 